Well, I think we have a, you know, we're f inevitably facing uh, lower overhead um, because we all need to reduce our costs because we have a number of factors that are pressing on us. Mm -hmm. The trends, you know, we have high returns from, because we still ship books returnably most of, most of our industry to bookstores, 40% average return, very high advance costs. Most of the advances paid out are unearned. Mm -hmm. um, that isn't slowing down yet. Uh, for the most part, and then we have the inevitable shrinkage of our revenue pie with um, with digital pricing. Mm -hmm. As as more of the books we sell are priced low as digital digital formats, mm -hmm. that's just there's nothing wrong with it, but it's less revenue to pay for all these people who used to be in the business. Right. So you have all these fa factors pressing in on our ability to pay the same number of people. Right, and it seemed like. Um playing those consequences out that one of the long-term ramifications could be um, the editorial sensibility would become increasingly trumped by basically by market research response. Well, you, you have, you'll have fewer editors to make that judgment or mm -hmm. fewer people in the publishing uh, doing the uh, gatekeeping. Mm -hmm. you know, fewer gatekeepers sitting around saying, how do, what judgments do we make? What interesting new ideas have we found? You know, so yeah, that's a potential worry that you'll have, uh, you'll be more of a slave to your focus group um, but it's just a bigger worry is that there'll be more work for fewer people. <laughs> so that's that's the uh, that's also frightening.